Where we're standing out right here, uh, we've got plenty of police vehicles and we've seen ambulances and uh, plenty of other emergency vehicles out here. But there is very little, if real, no police presence, security presence where we are because the action uh, and where they're trying to get people out of and we're trying to prevent other people from going in is all within the Capitol building. And, you know, frankly, whenever you come around this area, if we were here, let's say, one week ago, there are plenty of Capitol Hill police officers who are watching the perimeter of the Capitol complex. It's a massive complex. Um, you do see some, I guess there are some police officers sort of close to try to prevent people to get up from that side of Constitution. But the plaza here where you okay. see all of these people, that's just packed and packed with protesters. And that's really all you've got over there, Bill. Rich Edson, thank you. Eyes on the ground there with Rich. We can confirm now Fox News has learned that a shooting victim was transported from the U.S. Capitol about 35 minutes ago. Uh, no other details yet, but that timeline would sync up with the conversation we had with Kevin McCarthy right when we came on the air around 3 o'clock East Coast time when he heard a, a call come over the Capitol Hill police radio uh, that shots had been fired inside, and now the victim has been taken to uh, the local hospital. As we watch that, I want to bring in my colleague Chris Wallace, who was watching as well, and uh, Chris, we've got 90 minutes till sundown. I don't know what they do with the National Guard. We'll wait on that until we get greater clarification. Uh, but um, for the time being, you need to secure this place, and you need to get it done now. I couldn't agree more, Bill. Uh, and there are pictures that are out uh, that indicate that, at least in the case of the Senate, that protesters did get into the Senate chamber. There's a picture out, a still picture, you could see right there. Uh, of a protester who is sitting, just to give you context, that is the, the chair where the presiding officer 